But first, no. this is the story that is breaking right now. It's making the rounds on all the Twitter. Um, and we always have to be careful because mm -hmm. um, you can never joke about this. Mm -hmm. And you Ever. can never question any facts, mm -hmm. even nope. in the absence of any. Um, but AOC did a 90-minute stream on Instagram oh, live boy. yesterday. Riveting. And uh, um, there are a lot of claims in there. Let's start with, um, let's just, let's, let's let it straight from the, ho the horse-faced mouth. Like, I'm here. And the bathroom door starts going like this, like the bathroom door is behind me, or rather in front of me. And I'm like this, and the door hinges right here. And I just hear. She's got a future off Broadway. She? Where yeah. is she? I mean, I thought I was going to die. Is because these folks who tell us to move on, that it's not a big deal, that we should forget what's happened, or even telling us to apologize. No um, one said that. These no. are the same tactics of abusers. It just turned out where is she was the DoorDash guy <laughs> <laughs> with her chimichangas. Um, and I haven't told many people that in my life. Whether you <sighs> experience any thing. sort of trauma um, in your life, small to large, these episodes can compound on one another. There's no, you know, something really big happening to you and then you deal with it and then you move on and then when something else happens to you you deal with that okay so look i don't want to say because we don't know right yeah. um and you know they, some people say believe all women as they believe all facts and i think that if this True. happened listen aoc horrible if you were sexually assaulted these men should be buried beneath the railroad tracks okay does everyone yeah. else here yeah. agree Absolutely. sexual assault yeah. awful now why yeah. might i think it's a little bullshitty is Okay, go with me here, uh, because you equivocated, but right? yeah. you created equivalency between sexual assault and verbal abuse. You created mm. an equivalency between the Crips running a train on somebody locked in a closet for days on end and the insults from Gazoo. Mm. Mm. Not the same. <laughs> what I do you say? Dum dum. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> counselor yeah i just don't like when people say almost died when they didn't almost die <laughs> yeah. yeah i was behind well, the door that's the thing. Like, how, how can you prove what she's saying yes people storming the capitol if they're saying kill all the senators is a bad thing and you would want to run away from that and it would be kind of a scarring experience for us to endure right i would absolutely give you that but nobody can back up her story of what she's saying like if that happened then that's horrible that is terrible but did, did it really happen? Also, I don't believe I her it, for a number of reasons. very insensitive that the, the insurrectionists weren't asking, where is Z? Oh, that's true. Boy, yeah, this is a dead that's room. That's <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> I just don't know how I'm supposed to play this one. <laughs> I gotta be Should honest. Oh, Dave, yes, I said, or? Dave, don't make any rape <laughs> jokes because, else, of course, listen, mm. we're not. In, n rape is bad. Yeah, and I text got it. Now you can I'll say whatever you best. want. <laughs> <laughs> now he can make his rape joke well, and just, feel safe. Uh, yeah, it's just they were in there saying, "Where is she?" And I was in a closet. <laughs> and I was like, oh no. And it reminded yeah. me of the time that I was teased. Yeah, yeah. it was. I almost died because. Uh, you, well, nothing happened really. Nothing <laughs> really happened. Well, yeah, once she said that Ted Cruz tried to murder her, I think that's when I stopped believing her even more. Which, right. by the way, Senator Ted Cruz, you're welcome to be on the show, but it's not a softball. You've got some splaining to yes, do. A not a big bit. fan, Cruz. You guys could talk <sighs> beards. Cruz missile turned into more of a dud. <laughs> Yeah. What was that? <laughs> I was trying to Is that your wedding yeah, night? Was, no. no. So, oh, um, AO, and, then, and here she is now. She moves right forward AOC that. talking about. <laughs> <laughs> you can sh you follow the puck when Landau's laughing at my ribs on Gerald. Okay. No, don't do it. Do it. Do it. Gerald deserves everything he gets. <laughs> no. AOC. Now here she is talking about uh, speaking of Cruz, uh, yeah. recent disappointment. But I don't know. Hey, you know what, Senator Cruz? Some people are saying that you don't believe there was any election irregularities. Um, I don't. I want you to defend your position in your yeah. own words. But it does need to be defended. Just my opinion. This is. This is. A, I should yeah. have worn the undercover yeah. vest. Here's AOC <laughs> talking about Holly and Cruz. Is that when given another window of political opportunity for themselves? even if they know that it means that it will endanger their colleagues, they will do it again. And that's the real reason why I think that Senator Josh Hawley needs to resign, why Senator Ted Cruz needs to resign, along with many others, because they will do it again. They will do what again? Exactly. <laughs> what? The tall glass of unity. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Is it yeah. about the, this is the problem. It's like, look, we need to unify. Okay, we understand. Right. Those Nazis tried to kill me. 
How does this work? The, do you notice this happened with Barack Obama too? They were they were referring to George W. Bush as a Nazi. Yeah. Right. You couldn't Absolutely. actually say, you know what? Actually, I don't think George W. Bush is as bad as Halliburton. That was yeah. for about <laughs> yeah. eight freaking years. Yeah. And then when Barack Obama came in, they said, it's time for unity. It's time for unity, where the very first executive action was reversing the Mexico City policy, where our taxpayer dollars went to fund abortions overseas. Yeah. Donald Trump reversed that. And then Joe Biden, because priorities, made sure that your tax dollars are funding abortion overseas. Again, unity, unity. You need to resign. We need to impeach. We need to kick them out. And Ted Cruz tried to kill me. Oh, I don't know. I, don't, I mean, maybe we should unify yeah. uh, in telling you to go fornicate yourself with oh, a wire. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think we can do what what is the worst thing that Ted Cruz said throughout this entire thing? I mean, I'm really searching for the thing that she's saying that's what he said that yeah. made people want to murder me because he said, let's have a constant let's have an inquiry uh, over the next ten days, I think on on the sixth yep, and that's days. what he wanted to do. He was going to represent the states that filed the lawsuit in the Supreme Court that never actually got to the Supreme right. Court. Other than that, he said there were irregularities and things we needed to look into if if the if you're lowering the bar, fine, let's lower it for everybody. Every one of you who said something about Black Lives Matter and said it's fine to be out, you know, outraged and said that you're more likely as a black person to be shot by a cop than a white person, which is a lie, by the way, that incited yeah. people to violence, by the way. Let's call you before I the think Senate Judiciary the AOC is a petulant child who was carried by Satan in the desert and passion of the Christ. She was a little baby <laughs> on the what? shoulder. Really? Do you think she acts like a toddler? Flats. I think I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think she's evil. I think, look, no. I think, and we'll be doing a, a roast of Greta Thunberg tomorrow. That's one of the best things oh, that's happened. Oh, yes. yes. She's 18 now. Big so we're <laughs> not in violation of YouTube's guidelines right. really? in criticizing someone who serves to actually pressure legislative policy. And she was replaced <laughs> immediately when she turned 18. <laughs> she was replaced immediately. <laughs> like Michael Jackson seeing a pubic hair. Oh, no. <laughs> right out. And David Hogg wondering where all the people who said he was yeah. cute went to. Oh, sorry, David. Uh, and we're going to be talking about impeachment. Look, uh, yeah. do you think this is I guess this is my question here. Do you think that there's any constitutionality for impeachment right now? And uh, what do you think people believe at this point? Yeah. I feel like we are living in a world where it's a lie that is agreed upon. It, we're yeah. talking about COVID and double masks, and we'll get to that in a second. Actually, can we show that really quickly? I think we're going to tease this really quick because coming up, it's been a flip-flop. But remember when Dr. Uh, no Strings to Hold Him Down Fauci oh. said this about double masking? So if you have a physical covering with one layer, you put another layer on, it just makes common sense that it likely would be more effective. Turns out that's all bullshit. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, by the way, I think we're, we're breaking. We do oh. actually have um, some updates. We have oh. a, a, a mugshot of the attacker from AOC, if I see. Oh, yep. oh, well, oh, listen, oh, the means yeah. of reproduction. Yeah. 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 Terrible. <laughs> Don't mind the baby mega. So Reap what you sell. Watch Louder with Crowder live. Monday through Thursday, 10 a.m. Eastern.